Hi boys and girls, it's one of my favorite parts of the day. It's time for a story. And today in reading, you learned about parts of a book. So I'm looking at my book right now that we're gonna read today. It's called Hair Love. And this is the front cover. This is the back cover. And this is the, you're right, spine. So as we're reading today, you might see other parts of the books. This is called Hair Love. And it's by Matthew A. Cherry, and it's illustrated by Vashti Harrison. Illustrations are the pictures, so she made the pictures. My name is Zuri, and I have hair that has a mind of its own. It kinks, coils, and curls every which way. These are the illustrations or the pictures. Daddy tells me it is beautiful. That makes me proud. I love that my hair lets me be me. In funky braids with beads, I am a princess. And when my hair is in two puffs, I am above the clouds like a superhero. My hair even does magic, magic tricks. One day Rocky and I were playing outside when along came the rain. From large to small it went presto, just like that. There is nothing my hair can't do. I'm reading these words, which are called the print. That's how I know what to tell you. Today I woke up extra early all by myself. I was too excited to sleep. It's a big day. Ooh, I wonder what's happening today. Daddy was still sleeping. Shh, I said to Rocky as we tiptoe past him. Lately, Daddy has been worn out. He makes me breakfast, takes me to school, goes to work, picks me up, and yesterday we went on a bike ride around the park. I think he needs a break. Because today is special. I want a perfect hairstyle. This calls for a professional touch. Pause off, Rocky. Daddy heard the crash. Suri, what on earth, he asked. I wonder what she's trying to do. I was only trying to help, I, asked, I said. Daddy smiled. Can I help too? It'll be a piece of cake, Zuzu. The first style was no way. The second one was no better. No, daddy. Does your family ever do your hair and you say, that's not how I want it, or they give you a hat or an outfit and that's not what you were thinking in your brain? Then daddy tried slicking my hair back into two puffs. Ouch, daddy yelled. Uh-oh, the rubber band hit him in the head. Wait a minute, daddy said as he reached into the drawer and pulled out a pick. Ta-da! Daddy, really? I said. I'll be right back, he promised. Now, how's that, he asked, pulling a hat down over my eyes. Daddy, come on, we can do better than that. I really need my hair to be special. Don't worry, he said. We'll figure this out. Then I had a great idea. Ooh, I wonder what her idea is. Daddy gathered all the tools we needed and we were set. Watching carefully, Daddy combed, parted, oiled, and twisted. He nailed it. Funky puff buns, pretty, pretty, and so much fun. Rocky approved too. I put on my superhero cape as the final touch to a perfect look. Oh, I'm so glad she's happy with her hairstyle. Where's my Zuzu, mommy called from the door. She could not get in the house fast enough. Mommy, you've got to be the prettiest Supergirl I have ever seen, she said. Oh, her mom is home. And your hair is beautiful, Zuri. Who did it? I looked at daddy and beamed. Mommy smiled, very nice. 
Thank you. We learned from the best, Daddy said as he gave her a big hug. My hair is Mommy, Daddy, and me. It's hair love. Oh, what a great story. I hope you like the story too, boys and girls. And I hope you are seeing where the illustrations, the print were too. Well, I hope you enjoy specials today. See you soon, friends.